Hello, boys and girls and children of all ages. Fat Bash and Wannabe Boda coming at you tonight. Basically, I'm going to play some Hearthstone. I'm still going to be working on my little no spell um, warlock. What I actually like. I'm ranked 20. I don't expect to go any higher than this throughout this whole season. That's sort of where I'm stuck at. I don't want to obsessively compete and, or do a massive amount of time into this game. I play two or three games. Mainly what I'm playing is when I actually record. So I'm not playing anything outside of when I actually am recording this. So, Which is a good thing. It makes sure that the game... I have a tendency to burn out on games really quickly. Um, so as this just record, uh, I'm forcing myself to record. It's done a lot of things. It actually makes me get up earlier in the morning and do something at night besides necessarily read politics in um, economic tracks, which is what I normally do. Gul'dan versus Malfurion. Malfurion story. Unfortunately, I'm going against the druid. Let's get rid of this one and this one. I got the Morlocks out here. Hit confirm. Let's make the thing think I'm doing. All right. So I got some cult master in order to run these Morlocks into. Greetings. I greet you. My greetings. Level seven. Let's. I'm gonna coin and then I'm gonna tap into it, and I got both molten core and my giant in my hand. I'm sort of happy with this. Let's see how this works out. On turn two, I will throw a Murloc down. On turn three, I throw a Murloc down with my top. Turn four, I will throw my own um, Bolt Master down. Go ahead, hit me. I don't really mind. I got a question. I think I might, I might tap here in order to get my taunt out on turn uh, on turn three with the Murlocs behind it. So I'm gonna tap here, get this down to five. Good. And see if that's better. And also, I got my uh, act a lot of pain to get me some more um, draws. Okay, I can deal with that. Turn three, I'm gonna play my baby talk. Why do you and I'll play my Unfortunately, that pushes the uh, mountain giant up to six. But hey, that's okay. Hit next. Turn four, I start playing my Cult Master to see if I can get some card draw on it. Swag, never mind. Took care of all that. Uh, this is problematic. Now, I can plug my Murlocs out there. They'll just get ran down. My Acolyte of Pain. So many really possibilities. Pain. I'm going to um, live tap, see what I get. And I'm going to call it on that. I got one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, let's see. I'm going to call it on that one. I don't know if this is a very effective way to play this deck. I got a really cheap uh, Mountain Giant in my hand, but I will definitely probably play it next hand. I wish I could play it behind the top. What? You like my he's invention. looking for something. I wonder what he's looking for. Don't attack me. That gets that molten giant down to six. Down to f uh, um. He's at turn five, so. Have enough mana. And I don't 
don't have enough mana. Job's done. Let's see what he's gonna do. Turn six, I can get a tone out here. Or I can start buffing up my stuff. How's he gonna deal with a mountain giant? What to do? I got a level five mountain giant that I could play. Be really great if I could figure out how to get a charge on a warlock, but there's really no way to do it. In a warrior, a warrior deck, it will be great. Because right now I could be basically swinging for 16. It'd be nice to have my silence in here. I got a level four Tadingo. and a level two yeah. mountain giant. So mountain giant goes smacky smacky. Job done. Sixteen. Um, swinging for nineteen next turn. He's on turn seven. I'm at 12 health though. Hmm, I wonder. My shield for Argus. Oh, good taunts. Good taunts. And a crystal. What does he got in there? I've got a huge guy. Gonna deal two on it. He goes for the face as opposed to taking you down. Lens the sun well. Handle it. I wish I had a talk, but I don't. I'm at seven health. He's at seven. It's over. Well played. Well played. Just in the game. Well played. And I maybe should have took a little bit more time in that. I do think there's something to this deck. I just don't know. It needs tweaking too much. It's too situational. But it's an enjoyable deck to play around with. Um, I've been losing about 70% of my games with it. But they're always interesting games. Anyway, Fat Bash Wannabe Buddha. Have a good day.